All right, we are back in the booth, and I just wanted to do a kind of review on a new booth that I got from Pace. This is the new 36 inch deluxe peacekeeper. And I was just gonna go over a few things and how I set my cameras up or just in case somebody was interested in getting a paint booth. Oh, uh, the Pace has a um, very good um, extraction system in it, a 265 CM that I actually can take out of the top of the booth and right out the window of my shop and that keeps you know any of the fumes and stuff out of my building because i've really kind of set this one up to spray my solvent based paints but the booth really has a lot of features in it that are very nice it has toggle switches here for the lights it's actually got the fan switch which we're having a really rainy day here in georgia today i don't know if you're going to be able to hear it, but it's very quiet you can barely even hear it when it's on it's actually got two more switches for the power outlets here on the side that you can actually plug in for extra stuff like you know your compressor here i've got a little fortress two gallon i've got my uv box there i got some junk in the floor i haven't really set everything up yet but it allows me to kind of set things up um i've got my foldable camera holder for when i do videos i carry a small mask in here like i said i still haven't got it set up yet um i've got my youtube my not my youtube my um my gopro with a magnetic on it which i can stick on the side of the booth or i can actually put it in this flexible holder i've got a couple of um mr hobby magnetic airbrush holders and a tray but I put some lures in it just to show you the sheer size of this thing. It's very large. If you're, you know, painting multiple lures at the same time, uh, you'll be able to you'll be able to paint and have plenty of room in this big booth. Uh, it's you know the booth runs about seven hundred and eighty-five dollars. I've got the smaller version, which is a twenty-four deluxe, also but it's got plenty of room on the top of the booth, plenty of room to paint. It's got a, an extension here that you can actually take off. I like to leave it on so I have more room to set my stuff while I'm painting. I haven't actually done a video in the booth yet. I've just got back into town from working out of, out of town and I'm just trying to get it set up. Uh, I picked a horrible day to do it, but it is a very nice booth. I mean, the advantages of spraying with a booth versus not a booth. I mean, I don't have overspray going all over my stuff. And I, that's a big plus for me. And plus I didn't, in my other shop is in, in one of my other houses and I don't want to spray the solvent based paints indoors. So I've kind of just set this up to spray nothing but my house of colors, M SMS, whatever solvent bases I've got. Um, I'm working on putting an air conditioning and heating system in this building so I can actually come out here in the winter time also. But I just thought I would share the video. It is a very good product. You can look at them at paceboost.com. Um, I'm, not, I'm not sponsored by Pace. I've, I've purchased everything that, that's in the video. Uh, but it is a good product. And I, I just like to share things that may help somebody down the road. But like I said, the, the, the best thing I can tell you about having a booth is it gets the fumes away from all your stuff. You're not going to have overspray on your paint bottles or anything that you're working with. You know, I hope this um, is going to help some people. Uh, the difference between this booth and my other 24-inch Deluxe is I don't have the fan is actually separated on the top of the booth. This one's actually built into it. It's a lot easier for me. It, it saves me space. I got a lot of space on top that I'm gonna be able to put my paints, uh, blanks, whatever supplies that I need to store. So it actually works out really good for me. I mean, if you have any questions, you can put it down in the, in the box below. Uh, subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, hit the bell notification. So when you know I have upcoming videos, and like I always say, I'll catch you next time. Thanks.